Throwing right away is Rush. That open, that's complete to Dalton Schultz. And they work this well upfield across the 45. A good pick up there, 21 yards. Good job there to locate his tight end, Charles, in the middle of the field. Yeah, he has good pass catching abilities, and if they're able to continue to find him here in the early going, I think it'll help out his teammates out on the perimeter. You can take the big shots later if he occupies their attention. And the tackle going to be made at the 38. Back-to-back -back good plays have him on the move on first down. To throw is Rush. He finds his target. It's Schultz. And all the way inside the 15 before they drop him. That one goes for 24 yards. Here's a first and 10 at the 14-yard line. From the red zone now, they'll look to throw. Throw left side complete. That's Elliott. And he'll be out of bounds, taking it just shy of the 10 at the 11 or the 12. Now the first carry for Ezekiel Elliott. That leads us to a first and goal. It's a pickup of eight. Opening kickoff and marched it right down the field defensively. Not much resistance. And that's the point because my admiration is for the guys moving the ball right now. They know what they're doing. Their plan is working. Fighting for the end zone. He lost the football. It's out. And it's picked up by the Eagles. Pardon me, you know how often we hear about the red zone, right? From the 20-yard line going in, that scoring zone, getting points on the board. A lot of teams call from the 10-yard line in the green zone. That's your money zone. He fumbles the ball inside the money zone. You have one job, take care of the ball. That didn't happen. And a nice pickup as this one gets him to the 10-yard line. Seven yards on the pickup there, and it'll leave him with a second and three. And that run, that changes the whole mentality about the drive right there. They were starting on their own two-yard line. They just wanted enough space to punt the football successfully. Now they're talking about putting together a drive. A good run got seven on first. Here's second and three. Another run here with Sanders. And able to get it across the 20 before they get to him. It's an Eagles first down on a gain of 11. That's pretty much meat and potatoes right there, wasn't it? Just go right at him and let your big horse charge up the middle. Not too fancy there, was it? Nothing fancy at all challenging that defense. And on that go around, the offense won the challenge. Now this throw caught left side. And he runs all the way down inside the 40. A big play there for Philly. 41 yards. So how about that for a chain mover? They're all the way down inside the 40 now for first and 10. Hurts throw complete here to his receiver, Brown. And all the way inside the 15 before they drop it. Call that a very strong gain of 24. From the red zone now, they'll look to throw. Looking in zone, but it's incomplete. And we're going to see this offense try and spread the field a little bit and utilize the outside third of the field, especially against man coverage. But that time, the defense was up to the task, forcing the incompletion. And he'll fight his way down right around the 12. They do get a couple, but they'll be left staring at a third and eight coming up. Watching that play unfold and watching him complete it brought back memories of doing all those pursuit drills to make sure you don't over-pursue and let a guy get a cutback lane on you. He did that very well. You praised him on tape yesterday for the angles that he takes to the ball. Took a great angle right there. This defense not budging. Back-to-back -back carries of just two yards. Not a whole lot there. The defense was ready, it looked, for that run-pass option. You get the sense the next Next time he has that opportunity, he may keep it himself and get to the perimeter. Probably owes his back a little bit of an apology on that one, huh? And he won't get there. They stop him a few yards short. They'll get neither the touchdown nor the first down. And the Cowboys' defense is going to get him the football back. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys' offense. 
throwing here. Rush. He finds his man complete. That's Schultz. And that's good for a pickup of 10 yards. And that'll leave him with a second and just a few inches left. Rush. Got an open man. It's Michael Gallup. And he's going to get this one across the 30-yard line. It's his first catch, and it'll be good for 15 at a first down. Inside give to Elliott. And he'll work this one up to about the 38. It's a seven-yard carry to set them up with a second and three. Here's Rush to throw. Open man is Noah Brown. He's at the 30. A big play there on the catch and run. 53 yards. Well, partner, I'm not sure how this drive's going to end, but how about the way they flip field position there? A nice attacking play that picked up a heck of a chunk of yardage. Back to throw rush. This is caught. A gain of seven that time. Second goal. He decided to run a hitch route. It really helped to have a guy who can turn it loose. And boy, he rifled one in there on that one. Not much run after catch, but it worked really well. From the two now, second and goal. They'll try to run it in with Elliott. And this is not going to do it as he stopped at the two-yard line. No gain on the play there. They're going to need to come up with something better here on third and goal. They've been denied touchdowns in the red zone twice already. Here comes third and goal. Here's Elliott. And he will fight his way into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. Ezekiel Elliott taking it in from two yards out. And the Cowboys go nearly the length of the field and finish it off with six points. Extra point by Marr, up and good. And that makes the score 7-0. Following the touchdown, here's Marr to kick it away. And he'll decide to not bring this one out as their drive will begin at the 25. So back onto the field, here come the Eagles for their second drive. Well, they've got some stuff to build on from that last drive because they moved the football CD and then they tried to go for it on fourth down, didn't convert, probably left a bitter taste in their mouths. I would say so, and I think that they go out in this series determined for that not to happen again. In fact, he's got a man complete. Touchdown, Philadelphia. A.J. Brown, 75 yards. And the Eagles are able to strike quickly here as they are in for six. Elliott good with a PAT, and we are tied at seven. One of the shortest drives you'll ever see. One play, 75 yards, six points. So I'll leave it at seven now as they kick it away. And they'll put up the stop sign there as his guys will get it at the 25. The time to get another look at this Cowboys offense. The offense running out, and they are charged up, ready to go after reaching the end zone on their last drive. And normally I'd warn against getting complacent just because they scored the last time out. But I don't think there's any worries with this group right now. This is a hungry group, and they want to keep building off of their last drive. Now they just want the officials to hurry up and place the ball so they can snap it and get back to work. Here's the option going left on second down. And hit behind the line. He lost the football. It's loose. And it's picked up by the Eagles. And he is going to bring this back inside the 20 to the 18-yard line. So from inside the 20, here's first and 10 at the 18. Hurts. Touchdown, Eagles. Jalen Hurts on target to Dallas Goddard. And the Eagles have taken the lead. Elliott, and that makes the score 14 to 7. A nice tidy little drive there, getting the ball in excellent field position, and only one play to score. the 
touchdown. Here's Elliott on to kick it away. And they'll put up the stop sign there as his guys will get it at the 25. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. Last time out, they had the fumble that led to the touchdown. Not a great look on either side of the ball as the defense gave up the points to Charles, but they've got to take care of the football and do better here on this possession. It's certainly been a tough stretch, partner, for both of those units, and they kind of put their defensive mates in a really tough spot there by dropping the ball on the ground. But an easy way to make it up to them, get out there now and get some points on this drive. Start of the second quarter, and it's the Cowboys in possession as they've got it with a first and ten. Nowhere to go here. He lost the football. And it's picked up by his guys. He'll take over at the 25-yard line. He already had the one fumble loss, so now two fumbles lost here in this first half. Not setting the pace the way that you want it done. I mean, here in the first half, already twice the ball's come out and hit the turf. Got to find a way to take care of it. Otherwise, they may have to start thinking about maybe someone different in that position. So the pass incomplete in the end zone, but the flag comes out for interference. And now you're set up right on the doorstep of the goal line. One yard away changes what your play calls are going to be. Sanders is into the end zone. Touchdown, Philadelphia. So they brought the extra bulk in down on the one-yard line, and they're able to push this one across. Yeah, I can just see your face right now because I know we're mind-melding on this one. Coach Madden would love this. Power football, hat on a hat, chest to chest, driving forward, touchdown. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. And no thought to bring this one out. He'll just go down to a knee, and they'll take over at the 25. The Cowboys about set to take over on offense. They are looking to make a bit of a 180. They are sputtering right now. And frankly, I think it's time to call your playmakers together and say, all right, guys, we're going to lean on you through this patch. We need you to get us back on track and get us going in the right direction. So you're calling plays geared to them. Not necessarily what you look at your plays. Oh, this hurts the defense. I want the ball in the hands of X, Y, and Z and see if we can move forward. So don't get too cute. Go to the playmakers. Back-to-back -back good plays. Have them on the move on first down. Now rush. He's got a man complete. A big play here for Dallas. 42 yards. And this offense needed something to try and seize the momentum a little bit. That might have been exactly what they needed. Now they have a chance to go downfield and score and cut into the lead. Now Elliott. And from the nine, they get this to the five-yard line. This is a critical sequence here for this offense. Things really haven't gone their way so far. This could be their chance to get back into it, but they've got to find a way to punch this ball in. And this ball is caught by Lamb. Touchdown, Dallas. A five-yard touchdown catch, and the Cowboys have got it back to within a score. Extra point by Marr, up and good. And they're back with it, a touchdown at 21-14. Following the touchdown, here's Marr to kick it away. This will be fielded inside the five. And all in all, a pretty solid return. Nearly got him down officially at the 34. The Eagles offense set to begin their next drive. Now right now, we've got a little bit of an offensive masterpiece going on both sides, moving the football, scoring points. It's almost like somebody put the defense on. And that is caught, one-handed. Oh my, he pulled it in. A big play there for Philly, and even 50 yards. How about the first half he's putting together? Well over 100 yards already with that last catch. And to me, they'd be well served to keep looking his way. A number of big plays already in this one. 
So the big play means just like that, they'll operate from the red zone now on first down. Throwing his hurts. That is caught. It's the tight end, Goddard. And the Eagles are looking at first and goal as he's tackled all the way down at the two-yard line. Now receiver in motion left. Panther 11, Panther 11. Here's Hurts to throw. He will find Smith in the end zone. Touchdown, Philadelphia. Two yards on the touchdown there. And the Eagles have taken a two-touchdown lead now. Elliott Good with a PAT. And the lead now up to 14. Scoring summary. Three-play drive. And it was finished off by a touchdown from Devontae Smith. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. And this will not be returned. It's a touchback, and they'll begin at the 25. Dallas offense set for this next drive. A strong showing their last time out. They scored the touchdown, but Charles, they look up, and they're still down double digits, so you feel like just to keep pace, this drive probably needs to end in the end zone as well. Yeah, I think the best move for them is to not worry about how far they are down on the scoreboard, but to just remember the last drive and how it ended. Go ahead and try and repeat that. Then you can look at the scoreboard and see where this game is. The first down carry by Allian. A gain of three, second down. Not a huge carry there on first down, but not all of them will be. But still, all in all, a positive play for the offense. It's all about picking up at least a few to set up what you're going to do here on second down. And that play will go nowhere. Losing yardage back near midfield at the 49. It'll be a loss of a couple on the play, so now third down coming up. They'll come to the line here needing nine yards to pick up the first. On third down, Rush. It's complete to Brown, right side. So give him two yards there on the completion, and that's going to make it fourth down. On fourth down, here's Brian Anger now to kick this one away. And they won't risk defending a return here. That one's out of bounds, and it'll be spotted, spotted at the 14-yard line. Wide receiver A.J. Brown, you see he and the rest of his mates returning to the field here. Making his presence felt early in this one. First half, already over the century mark. How about the yards per completion? He's got a man complete. Pass the 20. Touchdown, Philadelphia. A.J. Brown with his second touchdown here in this first half. And the Eagles are able to strike quickly to add on to their lead. Elliott good on the extra point. Those are the ones the offensive coordinators dream about. One play drives from that distance. What an effort. It results in the touchdown. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. And no thought to bring this one out. He'll just go down to a knee, and they'll take over at the 25. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. They're down three touchdowns to this point, needing to put something together as they have it first and ten. Rush's throw pulled in by Lamb. He'll be dropped after a gain of about six across the 30 to the 31. They'll come up now second and four from the 31. Tenth carry now for Allian. And he'll be brought down shy of the 40 at the 30. 42 yards rushing for him now on what was his 10th carry of the ball game. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. They keep on the ground with Elliott. And a six-yard gain gets him right around the 43. Now, Brandon, that's the way you want to run the football. There should almost be quote bubbles above the offense right now. Bam, boom, biff. That's how they feel good about moving the football. On second down, Elliott. It's a pretty strong running there as he'll take this across the 50 and down to the 44. 13 yards and a first down, Cowboys. 
Now they'll switch it up here and look to throw. This will be caught by Brown. And he'll go out of bounds after taking it a little further down inside the 40. So give him five yards there on the pitch and catch. And that's going to bring up second down. Looking to throw. Rush. Oh, he tries to force it in, and it's intercepted. Chauncey Gardner-Johnson with a pick. And the Eagles are going to get this back to their own 34-yard line. Boy, we've seen a lot of mistakes here in this first half, and another there on the interception. Yeah, they're certainly starting to pile up, aren't they? Because, let's face it, we expect a miscue here and there, but they're already down three scores and still giving the ball away. If they want to get back into this one, They've got to take care of the ball because right now the way they're... And a big loss here as he's taken down. Micah Parsons showing off that elite athleticism as he gets the sack. I think this defense, Charles, realizing the deficit they're facing, they're going to have to step up and make more plays like we just saw there. Yeah, and those are the type of plays that can focus a defense because, as we know, they've had their trouble so far in this one. But they just proved to themselves that they can get to it. I expect them to continue to bring that type of pressure in order to try and turn around their fortunes. Backed up here, tough spot, needing 11 yards to pick up the first. And this is caught by Watkins. And he is going to have an Eagles first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. Let's just call it what it is. This has been a flat-out struggle for this defense all game long. They've really had a hard time slowing them down. And while I'm not big on speeches and guys jumping up and down, they might need their team leader on defense to get in their face right now and light a fire under these guys. They've got to start playing better assignment football and start getting guys on the ground. The Eagles going to take the first of their timeouts as they'll stop it with 25 seconds to go here in half number one. So a big play as it gets them all the way down to the 20 now for first and 10. Inside the red zone here, they'll look to throw. And on the catch right side, this is Sanders. And out of bounds all the way down at the three. 17 more yards on that one as they keep the drive rolling. How about the way they're moving the ball down the field? They had a big play a moment ago. Followed it up with another nice one here. And before you know it, they're already looking at first and goal. Dragon 60. Hurt sets up to throw it. Open, man, he's got him. That's Smith for the Philadelphia touchdown. Devontae Smith as the first half is winding down. And the Eagles continue to pull away here in this first half. Elliott Good with a PAT. And the route is on here in this first half. So not much time to speak of remaining in this first half as the kick's away. And not wanting to risk anything here late in the half, he'll just take a knee and they'll bring the football out to the 25. About set for this next drive by the Cowboys offense. And they're just going to run it here up the middle. And defensively, they're just looking to keep him contained as they're able to get him down. Now the Cowboys are going to burn the first of their timeouts as they'll stop it with 14 seconds to go in this first half. Throwing on second and three. Rush. And he went backwards. He'll be down at the 30. Now a timeout signaled for, and they'll get it with 10 seconds to go before halftime. And it looks like we've got a dime set here defensively. Six DBs in the game. Out of the gun, they'll look to throw. He finds his man complete. That's Schultz. And now we'll get a late timeout as it comes in the waning moments of quarter number two. And they line up now for what will likely be the last play of the first half. 57, Mike, 57. Back to throw. Rush. He's going to loft one deep over the middle. Over the middle, and it's incomplete. So we've come to halftime here in Philly with the Eagles on top as we'll get you down the coast to Orlando for Jonathan Coachman and our EA Sports Halftime Report. Coach. All right, Brandon, thanks very much. Welcome everyone to our brand new studios here in downtown Orlando in the EA Sports Halftime Report. This one, maybe not the hard-fought battle many had hoped for, 
This has been Blowout City thus far, but still more football to be played. Who knows what could happen as we send you right back out to Brandon Godden. All right, Coach, thank you, and we welcome everyone back for quarter number three. So the Eagles with the lead, and they're going to get this football first as the third quarter gets underway. And no run back here as the third quarter will commence with a touchback. Out come the Eagles now as he'll go on offense first here in the third quarter. Well, it's hard to imagine the first half going any better for them, CD. And now here as they begin their first series of the second half. I mean, they score here. This one, it's pretty much out of reach. We honestly might already be at that point, partner, because this team, they were dominant in the first half, continue to be dominant now. And I think they're viewing this as a put-away drive on their way to a lopsided victory. He's got a man complete. Touchdown, Philadelphia. A.J. Brown, 75 yards. And the Eagles come right out of the locker room and score here in the opening minute of the third quarter. Elliott good on the extra point, and the lead grows even larger here in the third quarter. That drive started on their own 25. Two plays, 75 yards later, into the end zone. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. And this will be a touchback, so they'll bring it out to the 25. The Cowboys offense now, they head out for their first possession of the second half. Throwing to start the drive. Rush. And he's going to be dropped following a pickup of seven past the 30 to the 32. They'll operate from the 32 yard line here, second and three. Off play action. Rush. Over the middle, complete. It's Ferguson. They'll get three as the drive continues. It's a first down. Operating from the gun. Rush. He's going deep for Brown. It's caught inside the 25. And he's going to be shoved out of bounds inside the 15-yard line. A big play here for Dallas. 52 yards. A real field flipper there as all of a sudden they've got a first down in the red zone. Back to throw again. Got his man complete over the middle. It's Schultz. Not quite the success they had last play. This one goes for three yards. Looking to throw again on second down. Rush and incomplete. From the snap, he certainly looked like he knew where he wanted to go with the ball, but surprise, that guy was covered. So that took his attention elsewhere to no avail. They head to the line facing a third and seven following the incompletion on second down. And he's going to be taken down, sacked back around the 18 yard line. Brandon Graham applied the heat off the edge. able to put this one through and they'll get back three but this remains a large deficit I'm kind of surprised by that that they kicked the field goal I guess you get some points but this deficit third quarter I don't know yeah I don't either yeah I'm with you on that one when you're down that much kicking a field goal does it feel a little bit maybe waving the white waving flag the way, I just want bigger points on the board Eagles offense and A.J. Brown headed back out there. Oh, this defense, they wouldn't mind not seeing him again for a while. <laughs> Three trips to the end zone. How about that? I think right now, they would... He's got a man complete! Touchdown! A.J. Brown, 71 yards! And the Eagles just continue to roll. Elliott now to add the extra point. And the lead grows even larger here in the third quarter. They certainly made quick work of that, ultra quick work. One of the fastest drives you'll ever see, just one play resulting in the touchdown. Oh. 
And there will not be a return here. It's a touchback, and it'll come out to the 25-yard line. So out come the Cowboys now as their offense gets set to take over. Well, we're still in the third quarter, so there's some time to kind of clean this up and make it look more respectable now. A win, that's probably gone out the window, Charles, but I, I don't know. Do you look at this as a time to just improve and maybe start to look towards the future? I think you have to find something to play for, something to grasp onto until the clock runs out. But, Brandon, we've been around this game a long time. This is an outlier. You don't get many blowouts like this no matter. And that's caught inside the 35. Yeah, he's got this to the 30 before being taken down. It's a gain of 35. So the big play has him all the way down to the 30 now for first and 10. Looking to throw. Rush. Under pressure and down he goes. They sack him back at the 36. Javon Hargrave, the D tackle, getting the sack. Protection certainly going to need to be a bit better here on second and 16. Another try after the first down sack. Rush got a man. It's Brown. And he'll be out of bounds as he gets it down to the 30 there. It'll be a gain of five. And that's going to lead to a third and 11. Back to throw. Rush. That's going to be caught. And he'll take it into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. Michael Gallup, 30 yards. And the Cowboys are able to at least get one score back. Extra point by Marr, up and good. So they do get one score back, but still a long way to go here in the third quarter. Following the touchdown, here's Marr to kick it away. Fields it right around the goal line. And he'll go down as this drive will start at the 25-yard line. Already at the line, this Philly offense set to go. Still comfortably on top, third quarter, as they start things here with a first and 10. It'll be Sanders to begin the drive. He's going to be dropped following a pickup of seven past the 30 to the 32. Well, no matter how they phrase it, staying on schedule, staying ahead of the sticks, whatever you want to call it, seven yards on first down, that fits the bill. Second down, back to Sanders. And he'll be out of bounds, but able to get it up past the 45. 49 yards rushing now on eight carries for him so far. But first down, Hurts. Launches deep. A jump ball, and this is caught. Only took him three plays, and they're already in the red zone, just like that. The dynamic duo is doing damage in this one, and they've certainly been on point throughout. And they hook up again for another big play. So how about this for field position after the big play? Inside the 15 now as they come up on first and 10. And that went a little too high as it's knocked away and incomplete. I see the surprise in your face there, partner. That is a rare incompletion from him. He's been on point this entire game. He has percentage completion-wise way up. Not that time. And it's caught. Touchdown, Eagles. Devontae Smith on the receiving end from Jalen Hurts. And the Eagles get another third-quarter touchdown to add on to that lead. Elliott Good with a PAT, and the lead grows even larger here in the third quarter. That time, 75-yard drive, five plays. And it was finished off by a touchdown from Devontae Smith. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. And this will not be brought out, it's a touchback. Dallas gets set to take the field. Right now, Charles, it just feels like they're trying to keep pace. They did score the touchdown last time out, but they still trail by double digits here. We'll see if this offense is once again up to the task. Yeah, and I think that after the last drive, they've gotten pretty revved up, don't you think? 
Everything they were doing was working pretty well. They go back out there with the same mindset, playing the same tempo and the same pace. Still a lot of time left to make something happen in this one. On second and seven, Rush. Looking left side, and he's got a man. That's Ferguson. He'll be hit down at the 33, five yards on the play. Let's not quibble about the game there on second down. That was a positive play because that was a take what you can guess situation. Got out to the tight end. Now it gives them a much better opportunity to convert on third down. They'll try and run for it with Elliott. And he's going to have the first down at about the 38. They get five out of that one, and it moves the chains. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. Looking to throw. Rush. Tosses the out route here to Gallup. And he'll be out of bounds after getting this one across the 40. Throwing again on second down. Rush. That is caught by Lamb. And he is into the end zone for a Cowboy touchdown. C.D. Lamb with his second touchdown of the night. And the Cowboys are able to eat in just a bit to this sizable deficit. Extra point by Marr, up and good. So they do get one score back, but still a long way to go here in the third quarter. Following the touchdown, here's Marr to kick it away. And he won't return this one. He'll go down to a knee, and they'll start at the 25. Wide receiver A.J. Brown. You see he and the rest of his mates returning to the field here. What a game for him, Charles. Four touchdowns. Heck, for a lot of guys, that's a good season number. <laughs> You're exactly right. And let's face it, we have to stand up and applaud this one, even though we're supposed to be neutral, because this doesn't just happen by accident. This isn't four times where the defense just falls down or breaks coverage. He's worked awfully hard, changing routes, changing areas, changing angles, and getting open for touchdowns. We knew he'd be part of the game plan in a big way and it has been in a very big way. And that is going to be pulled in one-handed. Wow. A big pickup of 38. I don't think we'll ever get enough of watching one-handed catches, and when they pay off, they are spectacular. But how about the times they don't pay off? And coaches go, two hands, two hands still works. <laughs> I know, but they, they go for them so often now that I'm almost starting to take them for granted. Yeah, that's unbelievable, isn't it? Because these are sensational type plays. Especially that. And this is caught. Touchdown, Philadelphia. Quez Watkins, a 24-yard touchdown. And the Eagles add another six points to what's going to be a blowout victory. Elliott good on the extra point. And this one was over a while ago as they just add on to that big lead. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. And no thought to bring this one out. He'll just go down to a knee, and they'll take over at the 25. The Dallas offense back out onto the field. But we said it at halftime that they would need a nearly perfect second half to erase that deficit that they were facing, CD. But unfortunately, the second half has pretty much been a carbon copy of the first. Yeah, that early lead was almost insurmountable the way their opponent was playing. And partner, they do have some good news, though. This one is getting close to being over, and they can try and hit the reset button starting tomorrow. And that one drops down incomplete. Good coverage there, forced the ball free, and it's second down. Back to throw, rush. Eagle pressure, too much this time, down he goes. Javon Hargrave, his second sack of the night. The offense on third down tonight, they've converted four times out of six, not bad. This will be third and 15. Operating from the gun, Rush. He finds his man, complete. That's Schultz. And they work this well upfield across the 45. Boy, a nice play there as they wind up converting on third and 15. On 
first down. Rush. That's caught again by Schultz. And he's out of bounds just before the midfield stripe at the 49. From just shy of midfield, Rush. Firing quickly here, and that's complete. And he's able to take it across midfield before going out of bounds. Coming up here looking for three yards to pick up the first. Again, he'll drop to throw. He finds his man complete. That's Schultz. And he will have a Cowboys first down, and he was able to get it by plenty. A gain of eight on third and three. Many different ways to create space, but on that play, he did it with that big, wide body of his. Didn't get a whole lot of yardage on the play, but it did what it was supposed to. Pick up a first down. And now a throw on first down there, but it's incomplete. This is certainly a team that has proven it likes to target its backs through the air and defensively. They were aware of that and certainly were prepared on that throw. On second and ten. Rush. Throw left side complete. That's Ferguson. And he's going to be out of bounds down around the 35-yard line. So they need six yards here on third down. They're two for two on third down tries so far on this drive. They'll stick with the passing game as he looks to throw. Open man lamb. It's complete. And he has another first down as he'll get the ball down to the Eagles' 20-yard line. Looking to throw. Rush. And that is caught. Touchdown, Cowboys. Dalton Schultz, a 20-yard touchdown. And the Cowboys get a small measure of revenge as they cut into this fourth-quarter deficit. Up and good as they make the score just a slight bit more respectable here in the final quarter of play. Following the touchdown, here's Marr to kick it away. Taking it about the one. And they'll start this drive just across the 30. Pretty nice work on the return. The Eagles offense set to begin their next drive. Well, they don't really need the points here, Charles, given what we're looking at on the scoreboard. But they've scored on three consecutive possessions, three consecutive drives. And I'm sure that they would like to keep that streak going here and continuing to pull it on. And things have gotten that way in the NFL, haven't they, partner? Because in the old days, people would, you know, they'd get off the gas a little bit, right? But now, people continue to accelerate. But we'll see what they decide to do as they come out for this one. But the way this game has gone, they've got to be awfully happy with their execution overall. A nice job there on the escape and scramble. A first down, a 16-yard gain. Hurd's going to keep it again. And down inside the 35, he goes to the 32-yard line. It's a second down run with Sanders. And they'll be inside the 25 now at the 24. Now what a first down pickup of eight. They'll go again with Sanders. And he'll get about five here as he'll take this down inside the 20-yard line. Hurts a handoff to Sanders. He'll get forward for three down to the 16-yard line. Seventh play of the drive now as they come up on a third and three. Now the second-year man, here's Kenneth Gainwell. And he is going to have an Eagles first down by about a yard as they're able to convert on third and two. They run behind center with Gainwell. And power running here down to the six-yard line. From the six now on second and three. They'll run with Sanders up the middle. And he's able to get it down to the two-yard line. Just 
just two minutes remaining here in the fourth quarter of what has been a one-sided affair. So it's Eagle football here as we get you reset. They've got it first and goal in a game that appears to have already been decided. Now they'll put a receiver in motion left. Seven pirates, seven pirates. They're going to look to throw and give them another six. It's caught for a touchdown, and the blowout continues. And Charles, they continue to have trouble stopping him as he's into the end zone yet again. Yeah, that's multiple series now that have ended with him in the end zone. A perfect plan on how to utilize it best when they get in close. Now after the touchdown, here's Elliott on to kick it away. And no effort to bring this one out. It's a touchback. And now here come the Cowboys. Well, CD, it's all window dressing at this point. I mean, the best they can do is end the game with a nice drive to maybe build some momentum to move forward into their next contest. Yeah, and with how lopsided this game has been, even one score might not do a lot of cosmetic good on the scoreboard, partner, because it's just about looking forward at this point. Get a touchdown here, give yourself some positive momentum and reps to focus on when you get back to practice in the next couple of days. They'll take this to the other side of midfield before going out of bounds. On first and ten, rush. Pressure comes and down he goes. The Eagles get there for the sack. Brave, bringing the pressure yet again. That's his third sack here tonight. Well, we all know this quarterback had to spend plenty of time studying prior to the game, but he has to be tired of seeing these guys, especially him. Third time now he's brought this quarterback down. Whole defense has had a great game, but three. And he's going to go down again. And Fletcher Cox, he's been doing this for a lot of years, and another sack to his ledger there. Need something from deep in the bag of tricks here after first and second down went backwards. It's third and very long. Now a desperation throw deep downfield, and that is incomplete. Here's Brian Anger now as he'll kick it away for the second time. Take it right on the 30. And past the 40 before he's out of bounds. A very nice punt that time, but they get 11 back on the return. And it will be Eagles football first and 10. And they take a knee. Ready, check. Time this offense they gave the nation quite a show putting up that many points to come away with what will certainly be a memorable win for them and Brandon I think it's as simple as this some players some teams they're just meant for the big stage and when they get a chance to play in this type of atmosphere where all eyes are on them and all the lights are shining brightly they show up and they show out Just about do it for Charles Davis. I'm Brandon Gordon. You've been watching the NFL on EA Sports. For more, log on to easports.com. The Eagles are winners.